morning viewer welcome to our globe globe to yes the argentinian conservation scientists are fighting to protect the tiny santa fe frog which is under threat as its habitat is one of the world's the rarest forest the dry chaco is cut down they discovered how it hides in caves emerging only to call for a mate and for the first time they found tetwals of the species it is not been an easy journey so far but we are determined to do what we can to secure the future for this wonderful amphibian said isis ivanez who leads the santa fe frog project based in win ayors the santa fe frog is largely unknown to science despite being discovered more than a century ago found only in argentina bolivia and paraguay the fog is now rare due to the loss of the tropical dry forest in which it lives the researchers set up camera traps to locate the brightly colored frogs and study their behavior most frogs attract a mate by calling loudly from a pond stream or swamp but this species lives underground the team found the males emerge at nightfall to advertise their presence then hoped back down their boros with interested female after digging for hours at night they eventually found evidence of eggs and tetwals for the first time investigating the frogs breeding behavior is the first step towards protecting it in the wild by drawing attention to the plight of the frog the conservation scientists hope to highlight the biodiversity of the dry or grand chaco and other animals at risk of extinction this species is a clear example of why we have to defend the forest in dry chaco said team member camila diostos we don't have much time the scientists are also liaising with local community leaders hunters and farmers to learn more about the frog and how to better protect it the grand chaco is a large expanse of forest and dusty plains startling parts of bolivia argentina and paraguay the chaco woodlands have been gradually cleared over the past few decades to make way for cropland land and ranches the forest has one of the highest deforestation rates on the planet though it attracts less attention than its amazon neighbor the area has been dubbed ai impenetrable and urban hall on earth for its in accessibility and extreme temperatures yes temperature can reach 50 degrees celsius in the daytime and there is very little rain yet wildlife thrives in the harsh conditions including hundreds of different birds mammals reptiles and amphibians it is a dry forest with an incredible biodiversity said gabriela agostini amphibians are a high risk of extinction a pathogenic fungus has been ravaging populations around the world for about 40 years the animals are also under pressure from habitat loss and hunting the santa fe frog project is supported by the conservation leadership program that's called clp an initiative run by fauna and flora bird life international and the wildlife conservation society bien the zipot glory globe tv delhi india